Hello, everybody, or nobody yet. How are y'all doing? <clears throat> Excuse me. If you're watching this later, which everybody will be because no one knows I'm going live right now, welcome in. Hello, hello. I have a ton of new crystals that I haven't opened yet. I've got one box that I've opened that I'm going to like unpack, re unpack, really. And then I have this box here that I haven't touched yet. I've got to get some stuff out of these boxes and onto the crystal table for Sunday. Um, and it's just, it's a process. There's a lot here, so. Here I'd go live and do a little sneak peek. And let y'all know that this week's sale is gonna be on Sunday, not on Saturday. Um, and that may be the new thing because it just seems to work a lot better in my schedule. So hopefully y'all don't mind. And we're gonna jump right into these lovelies. I don't even remember what's in here except for, whoa, whoa, um, I remember this now. Oh my gosh. I gotta get one of these out. These are all tiger by blue tiger by, they're like little blue tiger by marbles. I also got strawberry quartz towers, well, it's red adventuring. Uh, they're not technically strawberry quartz. Mm. Okay. So these guys, I'm going to have a ton of these for sale and they won't be going for too much money because they're a little baby. Little baby tiger's eye. They're blue. Oh, there's some good flash on that one. If I can get it to show. Isn't that always the way? Do you see the little blue in there? These are fun. I'm going to have to sell these in like little lots or something. Get some better lighting on them too. When I have the them on the table, they're all in varying sizes too. Look at the size difference. These are fun. They're like little marbles. I don't know what to expect from that, but I'm kind of digging this. Ooh, this one's got a lot of red in it. Look at that. I think I'm show a couple of these for y'all, whoever's coming in here later. Well, this is really not working today, is it? <laughs> you can see my eye in there. Hello. Fail. Well, you're just going to have to trust me, and you'll have to come back on Sunday to see him up close and personal on the big camera. Huh, I'm going to have to figure out how to even price these. I don't even know. This might be like some, uh, what do they call it? Intuitively chosen items. In other words, you request however many you want, and I'll just pick some out for you or something like that. We'll have to see. That's that's interesting. It wasn't quite what I was expecting, but that's okay. Um, hopefully these are the towers. The problem with the towers, my problem with the towers, is that I love them. And I will want to keep them all. I've already got two red adventuring towers, and I just can't. I just can't help myself. I just think they're so great. I want them all. Oh, these are not. Oh wow, look at this. I forgot I got aura crystals too. These are titanium aura crystals. They're quartz, and then they are coated in this titanium coating to make them this iridescent color. I totally forgot about these. Wow, that one's really cool. Oh my gosh, well, how do I even? I like gotta go through all of these, right? This is fun, fun. What's the next one look like? They're gonna all be so different too. Four sixteen. Ooh, look at this guy again. I don't. I don't even know how to price these. I'll have to figure that one out. He's a key bell one. Look at all the crystal clusters. That's so cool. They are real uh, crystals underneath them. Oh, that is so neat. Look at the bottom. So obviously they set it on some sort of grate and must have coated it from all sides, you know? And then you kind of get the pattern of the grate underneath. That is neat. I kind of really like that. That is unique. Okay, what's next? 
I don't know how many are in here. I mean, I got a bunch of them. I just, they, you know, they just pick them for you. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, okay. So here's the bottom again. The little mesh on it. Wow, look at that. It's more like a druzy kind of thing going on there. There we go. You wait long enough and the camera is a little nice to us. Look at all these clusters. That's so cool. Oh my gosh, look, there's a Jersey pocket in there. That is so freaking neat. Wow, that's beautiful. I am so excited about that. I'm really pumped about these, y'all. I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna sell these. That's I gotta I gotta keep at least one of these, right? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I really kind of like this one jumbo point. That's kind of cool. But I, that last one's for me too. I don't know, man. They're also different. Ooh, this one. I like this one too. Actually, one of these I'm gonna have to give probably to my kid. He was talking about rainbow crystals recently. I can't remember why. This is pretty much as close as it gets to that. Rainbow crystals. That's a nice little cluster. That might be the one I keep. I like that. This one's really cool too. Man, how do you decide? How do you pick these? How do you pick which one to keep? They're so cool. Looks very like golden yellow on this side and then hot pink on that side. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to pick these out. Price them or pick them. I don't know. Man, let me see. I'm going to just go run into my own YouTube really quick and just make sure no one's hanging out in the chat that I can't see through StreamYard. Because that does happen occasionally. Um... But as I said, no one isn't going live right now, so it's possible. That no one's here. I don't know. Sales going. Really. Oh, hey, there, I'm back. Hey, <laughs> hello, hello. Um, okay, so I'm frozen. Let it go, let it go. Da 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 dee dee dee. Something, something. My kids didn't really like the frozen movie. I wasn't a big fan either. Oh my gosh, this one feels awesome and huge. This is more of this aura quartz. I'm back! <laughs> hello, hello. Uh, those last pieces are pretty sweet. This one feels like it's a big, big jumbo boy. So let's see. Check it out. Look at that big point in the back. That is so darn cool. This guy's got some heft to him. Oh, and there's the bottom. He's got the, the mesh design on the bottom, too. That's pretty darn cool. I'm not going to lie. I I don't know. These are truly interesting, unique. These would be cool for, like, kids. I feel like kids would think this is the neatest thing ever. I love the clusters going on in there. Or the points all, like, going in different directions. I know, we'll get a better look at it later on Sunday. I don't know what my BTI is. Oh, these are uh, titanium quartz. 
also known as aura quartz. So uh, but basically they have, these are real crystal clusters and you'll have to go back in the video to see all of them. They're real crystal quartz clusters and then they coat them with titanium. So they have this metallic rainbow effect. Check out that guy. These things are so dang neato burrito. This is a really nice one. They set it up, I presume, on some sort of metal grate so when they spray it, they can get it from all angles and it leaves a pattern on the bottom of some of them. Some have it, some don't. Like this one doesn't, but this one does. I think it's neat. I like it. Yes, it does, doesn't it? Superman's home planet. Which I can't even think of the name of right now. And that's not what what's his name? Kal Kalel? Is that Superman's real name? What's his real name? What's his like given name? Hey Teresa. Oh, thank you. I want I've been dying to like go lighter. But now like my roots are super light and the rest is a little dark. But that's okay. We'll work it out eventually. Eventually it'll be what I want it to be. All right, here's another one. I've got a bunch of these. I think I might have to spread these out over a couple shows. And there's that guy. Very cool. It's the bottom of them. All right, well, that, that does it for the titanium quartz, I think. Oh, I lied. I'm lying. I'm full of lies. I got one more in here. All right, let's do this last one. And then I think the adventuring towers are what's left. Krypton! That's what I was thinking of. You'll have to educate me a little bit on Superman because uh, it's been a while. And I never really was into him too much. Okay, this is neat because you can see, if you like look down into that crack, you can see the, the milky quartz through there that failed to be coated, which I think is kind of neat. There we go. So this is the last one. Man, there's uh, there's some winners in that bunch for sure. Okay, let's see. Real name is Kel Al. Okay, all right. So I know I know a little bit. A smidgen. But I haven't watched that show in a long time. All right, so these are the Red Aventurine Towers, a.k.a. Strawberry Quartz, which is inaccurate, but that's what it's known as. Yep. Yep. I'm going to have a hard time letting these go. This is one of my favorite materials. I just think it's so darn pretty. And they sparkle. So that sparkle is like a uh, aventurescence. That's a thing, aventurine. Oh, this one's got a little ding a doo on the side but who cares it's still gorgeous a ding a doo i don't even know where i come up with these things <laughs> i mean i guess i guess it's graffiti do you think they ruined the specimen underneath i don't know i think it's kind of cool all right so we've got a ton of these guys coming up I'll have to dig through my box. I don't know what this week's BTI is going to be. I really, truly don't because this thing stands. So look at the bottom of them. It's all like skinny. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, yeah, I just don't know. A box over there week instead of the BTI. Alrighty. I've got more of these. Oh, I love these so much. This looks more like an actual strawberry quartz, actually. That's interesting. So strawberry quartz, like, if you want to get technical about it, is kind of like more of a clear quartz that has speckled little reds in it. It's kind of what this one looks like. The red adventuring is more like that solid color all the way through. These do kind of look more like strawberry quartz, though. They say it's more rare. Who knows? There's like a lot of conflicting information out there about crystals, honestly. 
And some of them look so dang similar. They get sold as the wrong material all the time. So you just gotta be, uh, you gotta be educated, a little educated. Who popped in? Hey, Annette. Hello, hello. I'm just showing off some crystals for Sunday. Ooh, this guy's a little more tall. I just my lighting's not the greatest right now either. Just heads up. See the sparkle? I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I mean, I honestly, I could just have an entire display of these and like smoky quartz and I'd be happy girl. I love them. But I already have a ton. I already have uh, a lot. I've got at least two of these. I have a ton of quartz though. Like an insane amount. Anywho, I also might have some uh, items this week that are available because they were unclaimed by people. Ooh, this one's nice and deep. It's like raspberry jelly. That's a really nice saturated color on that one. It's a little lighter one. These would be so pretty. Oh my gosh, if you had, ooh, had them lined up and then put a rose quartz here and a clear quartz and had like the ombre effect of your towers, that would be awesome. I'm going to have to see if I can do that. I don't have a clear quartz tower, though. But but if anybody wants a pumpkin for $20, <laughs> you let me know. I'll sell it to you right now. I'll sell five of them to you right now. Um, Let's see. That's, that's it that's in this box. Uh, let me ask you all. Do you want me to show you what's in the other box that I've already opened? because I have to re-unpack it because I opened them all upstairs. It's another one of the lighter one and a darker one. <sighs> I love these. I love them. I really like these. Anywho, um, I have to re-pull that back out. So I opened them upstairs and then I had to pack them up and put them in a new box because the other ones were completely saturated and wet. I couldn't move the box without fear that the whole thing was going to fall apart and spill crystals everywhere. So now I have to pull them back out of the box. If you guys want to see what's in there, uh, Jonathan looks very enthusiastic about that prospect. So we will do that in one hot second. All right, that's it. This is the smallest guy. Look how skinny he is. I look the way they cut that. And that one, and that one, and that, 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 that. These do look more like strawberry quartz. Interesting. Very interesting. They might technically be like both. Aventurine is in the quartz family. So we had to split them up by color. I don't know. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Okay. Well. Here, green. Yeah. You know, Aventurine is green, usually. So that would be kind of fun to have like one of each. All right, let's see. Uh yeah, I know. My light is crap. I'm sorry. <laughs> pumpkins. I got lots of pumpkins. Oh, man, a meeting. Womp womp. Okay, let me let me grab this box. It's like on the other side of my table, so just don't don't go anywhere. I got to figure out how I'm going to tackle it. It's big. I mean, like, legit, this whole box is full of Christmas. Can you see this? Can you see Christmas? This is a giant diaper bag. This box has got to be, like, 14 inches by 14 inches, give or take. And I don't know how deep it is, but it's, it's also deep. So, let's do it. Hey, Brandy. Hello, hello. Welcome in. All right, so these are these are just sneak peeks. I might have to clear some space on my table here. I mean, I'm gonna run out of space like to set the new inventory on. Twenty dollar pumpkin. Um. Okay. So, all right, we have these. I've only got two of these. They are almost like mosaic um, ammon ammonite fossils onto these plates. I've got two of these 
And what I do have also are little display stands so you can set them up. <sighs> I think they would be cool in the window. There's some light that will shine through them. They're just fun little fossil discs. And like I said, I've got two. So here's the other one. Oh, thank you. Thanks so much. I, I don't know. I really like this color. It's a bit light and orange up here. And I don't know. Whatever. I just felt like doing something different. Oh, thanks, Brandy. Thank you. You guys are awesome. I'll be, this is, I don't know how long I'm going to go. I got to pick up my kids soon and figure out dinner. But what would you guys do if you were me? Would you make dinner tonight or would you order out? And if you order out, <laughs> would you get pizza or sushi? Because I'm telling, telling you, I'm really leaning towards sushi. Um, okay, so here we go. This one is pretty darn cool. It's a black opal flame. That guy's going to be on the table. Just do a quick little flashy flash. And he does, he is a self-standing one. Pick about two of those. Yeah, I think this is the other one. Who popped in? I feel like I'm in. Oh, hey, Rochelle. I didn't see you come in. Hello. Hello, Anitra. I know you said you like my hair, but I want to say thank you again. Aw, Ned, you're so sweet. Thank you. Pizza, everyone's saying pizza. I feel like we get pizza like once a week, though, because my kids are crazy and always want pizza. All right, here's the other one, the other black opal flame. He's a bit more of like a, a chunky fellow. It's like it's like the burglars in any movie ever where you have like the stout fat guy and this tall skinny guy and they team up and go cause havoc. And this guy's the brains and this guy's the dumb one. Why am I? I don't know why I'm going there with this these things right now. But anyway, <laughs> this has a really awesome design like the stone there. It might not allow me to show you right now, but you'll see on Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. I know. Pizza, everyone's saying pizza. Maybe we'll get a pizza for the kids and sushi for me and me and the hubby. All right, now this one. Oh, he's got a little sticker residue on him. Ew. But it's pretty. This guy. This is garnet. This is a garnet sphere. Super, super cool like heavy but in the right light it's very sparkly and you all know I like sparkle if you don't I like sparkle so this this appeals to me a lot it's like this really deep deep burgundy with the sparkles all over it. it's very very gorgeous one and then we have this that I don't remember what it is um I don't know. My guess would be a Jasper of some sort, because when in doubt, it's a Jasper. But it's this peachy, like, really lovely peachy color, and then it's got this streak of gray through it. It reminds me, reminds me of, it's not, but it reminds me of Bumblebee Jasper. But I really like this, that line going through there. So that's another fun one. Um, I've got a handful of tumbles. Tumbles for days. They're actually, I guess they're not technically temples because they, they are carved into shapes. Well, these ones, I don't know. So I've got this rose quartz heart in there. There's a labradorite heart. Tumbles. Oh, and let me show you what I found in one of my bags. I don't know if this incite, excites anybody, but um, these. It excited me, okay, because I'm always looking for... Uh, different ways to display spheres and I found these in a jewelry bag I maybe they're napkin rings they might be napkin rings but there was only two of them and I thought hey maybe a sphere stand eh so uh those are gonna be available <laughs> I have a couple of those I have these like wood ones too these are definitely napkin rings but I don't I don't know I don't know if they really I don't know how I'm feeling about that one, but we'll play around and see what happens. 
Do I have any Desert Jasper? I don't think so. I'll go back through and look. Are you saying this might be Desert Jasper? Not quite. It's a bit too spotty. Maybe Ocean Jasper, though. Could be. Could be some OJ. Who knows? Mouth eye. All right, all right. I gotta, I gotta hurry up, especially if I gotta order pizza. <gasps> I forgot about you. All right, hold on. I'm gonna get the sticker residue off of him. Sticker, sticker, residue. Are right, you all ready? Y'all ready for this? What does she have? Um, <laughs> it's a tower, and it's a big one. I'm trying to remember if this is fluorite or, or amethyst. I think it's just amethyst. Pretty sure it's amethyst. Sometimes they look similar. But it's huge. Look at this thing compared to my hand. Okay? That's a big chunk. Isn't that huge? Thank you. I know I'm going to be on like the lookout now for napkin rings. I'm always on the lookout for like unusual things to use as sphere holders. In fact, I have this thing over here. I'll show you really quick. I found this at a thrift store, <laughs> but it's like a, I think it's a cupcake stand or maybe it's for, um, maybe it's for uh, like candles or something. And like the candle dishes are missing. I'm not sure, but I thought it'd be fun for spheres, so I'll see if I can get that to work out. I don't have enough spheres to fill that thing yet, though, so. What else, what else, what else? Oh, this guy. All right, thanks, Anitra. Thanks for popping in. Appreciate it. That's trash. Let's see if I can make it into my makeshift trash can. Eh, almost. Um, this jewelry business. Yeah, I know about that. All right, so these, this is another amethyst. This one is really super gemmy and pretty and beautiful and I love it. I have another one on the way somewhere in the pipeline. This one, there's a lot to look at inside this thing too. I love this. I love this. I love stones that you can look inside of. And that's what this is. This one's super pretty. Um, I'm having a hard time letting this one go. I've got one similar to it. That's the only reason that I'm okay with getting rid of it. They also call these, uh, oh, there's a rainbow in there. Amethyst diamonds. You know how they're always giving names to things to make them sound cool. More appealing, whatever, marketing, blah, blah, blah. Uh, is there anything? Yeah, nothing in that bag. Oh, this one. This one. Whew. It's a little dusty. Got a celestite egg. I feel like I can't show you guys everything that's in here. I don't want to ruin all my tricks. But look, he's got a little peekaboo cluster on the back too this egg let me tell you i got i'll give you all a good deal on this one i got one similar to this is a little bit bigger a little bit darker a little bit gemmier like 150 bucks this guy is sizable he's not as big as uh jonathan's beautiful celestite heart it's probably about half the size of that but it's still really awesome so if anybody saw the heart from a couple weeks ago that jonathan scored We'll have that guy. And that one's gorgeous. Okay. What else? What else? What else? I'm so excited to set my table. Y'all don't understand, like, how much. Well, yeah, I know, but I don't want to ruin everything. Oh, here's a flame. Shoot, is this another black opal flame? Do you love how I can tell what my things are that I bought? Not. Got another guy. No, this I think this is another black opal one. They're all so different. It's so similar. He's got a little bit of botryoidal uh, growth in there. A little the bubblies. I like this one. It's like creamy mocha 
cafe latte on the side there. That's like legit the name of uh, this nail color. <laughs> My nails are like, I can't, I can't decide what color to do. So this one ended up all being one color and then this one is like three or four different colors. I can't remember. Anyway. I know y'all are here to talk about my nails and not crystals. All right, what is this? Oh yeah, towers, little towers, baby towers, towers for babies. Do I show you now? I guess I should show you now. All right, so we've got this little, this smoky guy, which I have some smokies over here, but this one's uh, a bit more saturated and he's skinny and he's got some shiny sparklies inside of it. When I do this, do I look cross-eyed? When I do this, do I look cross-eyed? I think so. Pretty. Um, okay, so that guy. And then this, I got another uh, Rudelated Quartz. Where is he? Oh yeah, he is Rudel, okay. He's not, he doesn't have as much Rudel as the last one I had that I recently sold, but he's got quite a bit in the tip there. A bit of root heel in the tip. Tip sounds so dirty, doesn't it? I can't say that word. All right, here's the flower agate, aka uh, cherry blossom agate. Tower. I have one more of these that I was going to sell for my personal collection because I got another one that I liked a little better. So I may have two. I may just have that one. I don't know. Um, oh my gosh, I have just like a bunch of smalls down here. You guys are going to see everything. Ooh, I forgot about these. Selenite palm stones. With a lotus flower carved into it. I got two of those. Those are pretty. All right. This is just the oven. But I need to open it. I don't know. I don't know if all this stuff is going to make it onto the table. Honestly, truly, because I only have so much space, so much time. And I need stuff for next week. Although I should have a giant box on the way. I got sucked into another crystal auction last night and the night before. You know, crystal auctions in me are dangerous. I know some of y'all know that because you buy from me, but you might buy from other people too. I'm the same exact way I do it with other people. I get sucked in and then I'm like in my head trying to figure out, I'm trying to calculate like how much is my bill going to be? And it's always double what I'm anticipating every single time. Like, dang it. Oh, well, more pretty crystals. Not a bad problem to have. Oh my gosh, this one. Oh, Jonathan, this might be the BTI and anybody else who's paying attention. Maybe. I can't remember. I can't remember how much um, this one's going to be up for. This is an Ocean Jasper. And he's beautiful. Okay, sorry. I don't know if this will be it or not, though. So he has huge pockets in him, and that's like a iron oxide in the pocket so that's why it looks so very red all up in there all right hold on i gotta get this thing to focus okay there we go does it not look like a planet this thing is so cool it's got a druzy pocket in there he's fabulous i love pockets and stones it's my favorite so that doesn't bother me one bit and look you can see it look by this finger up here there's like a pocket that goes through. There's like a bridge. So if I can catch it right. See the little hole? Super awesome. I'm, I will love this piece. I love this piece. Especially the Druzy. The Druzy, everybody look at the Druzy. Okay, he's chilling. I'm gonna do the end of it. That 
might be all. I don't have too much other stuff in here, just some smalls. But we have this guy. He looks, he's the same, uh, he's the same stone as the pumpkins. That I can't figure out what it is. Suffice to say that's probably a quartz of some sort. But he's like this beautiful orangey red color. Howling Wolf, I've only got one of him. I I will like always, if the opportunity arises, I will always buy wolves and owls. I don't know why. Well, I do. I really like wolves. Owls, I'm really not even that big of a fan of, but I know that like a lot of people like them. So when I get an opportunity to get the owls, I try to get the owls. And I do have some owls coming. Um, they won't be on the table tonight, though. Okay, that might be it. That might be it for this batch. All right. There's a lot of goodies in there. I'm just going to do a little quickie of my table. Now, some of these things are going to be removed. And uh, a lot of, or like everything. <laughs> Everything is going to be reorganized. So. That's it. That's it. That completes today's sneak peek of all things. I'm really pumped. I really like this guy. And I'm so freaking pumped about these. This is really exciting for me. All right. So that's it. Any questions, class? Uh, what kind of sushi am I going to get? That's my question. Um, yeah. And if anybody wants... A $20 pumpkin that is stone. Say the word. I'm going to try to sell these on Instagram. I don't know. I've never tried selling anything directly off of Instagram. Today may be the day. We'll see. All right. That's it. I got to organize and price things out. And I guess that'll be it for tonight. And I will see you all on Sunday. Thanks so much for tuning in to get a little sneak peek. Sunday at 5 p.m. Eastern, that's when I'll be on. Hey, Gina. Oh, and while some people are in the chat, I just did a massive ship shipment. So I ship on Saturdays usually. I try to make that my shipping day. But if I can get out earlier in the week, I will. I just like to tell everybody Saturday so I have the full week to deal with it. And then Saturday, like, I will definitely be out by then. Um, so today was Friday. And I got everything out if it's been paid for, unless I've talked to you and you know what I'm holding or if I'm holding or you've asked me to hold stuff, then I'm holding it. But otherwise, everything's shipped. So if you bought something last week, it shipped. All right. Um, Jonathan, we did not decide on BTI. You'll have to come in on Sunday to see what it is. I haven't decided it yet either. I'm going to have to figure it out. I might not have one. I don't know if anything on this table is because uh, usually the BTIs are over 100. I don't know if anything on the table is over 100 this week. We'll figure it out, though. I'll do, I'll do something, maybe. We'll figure it out. Okay, that's going to be it, y'all. Please show the wolf on the Sunday. We'll be on the table. I think probably everything I've shown on this video hopefully will be on the table. I think. I'm, I might just, like, hold back on some things. Like, I have a lot of these titanium quartz guys. I might hang out with some of these till the... Oh, why is my voice cracking? Till the following week. So, um, but yeah, pretty, everything you've seen, I should have on the table. Okay. All right. Wolf will be on Sunday per your request. And I'll try to see what I can do for BTI. And that's going to be it. That will be it for now. All right. Have a lovely weekend, y'all. And I'll see you to complete the end of the weekend. A couple days. Have a lovely night. Stay upbeat and happy and love everybody. See y'all later.